Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. I'm so happy you're here. In today's video, I am doing a clean and organize and declutter of my kitchen. Now this is part two. I did post part one, I think a couple of weeks ago. Um, by the way, in case you guys are wondering, I have a whole entire series playlist um, and I will link it down below in the description box. But today I'm just cleaning out this really messy junk drawer and a couple of other cabinets that I really wanted to clean out. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed and let's get into the video. All right guys, so before we get started with decluttering some of the drawers that I wanted to get to, I am going to just tidy up my kitchen. My kitchen was not as messy as it usually is, but I just wanted to tidy it up because I'm going to need a counter, which is my main counter right here to set things on and go through them. So we are just gonna tidy this kitchen up and start going through the drawers. I'm sorry that I do not have before shots for you. I actually did film them, but for some reason, when I am putting them in to my video to edit, they are not working, and it's more of like a slideshow. I'm not really sure why. It's kind of weird. It's never done that to me before, so I'm sorry I do not have before shots for you guys, but you guys will see what the statuses of my drawers once I open them. My junk drawer is an absolute disaster. The um, cabinet below that was a disaster and I got rid of some stuff in there as well as my junk drawer. And then I just reorganized my container um, cabinet where I keep all my containers. Um, I do have more containers that I need to put in there. I just have been lazy and not wanted to do it. So I hope you guys enjoy these clips of me tidying up the kitchen and then we will get to cleaning and decluttering. You're pulling on my walls down. I've never been exposed like this before. I'm good at shutting you out I've always had a way of keeping closed Beating, hiding, I've been calling out your name From the darkness, thinking it's too late If you find it, I've been too much on your plate I'll keep hiding She got me out in the open Now I'm ready to dive in I know you told you it would be a slow burn Okay, so this was the status of the drawer. As you can see, everything is just shoved in there. We have all kinds of things in here. Um, we have manuals from like the appliances that we have, like our waffle maker and stuff like that. And then we have um, some of the things that we used to barbecue with, which is what I was taking out of there right then. Um, and we also have a lot of cards that are just ripped out of their packaging from Gio because he, when he was like younger, he knew that the cards were in there. 
and he absolutely loved playing with them. Um, and we would just find them all over the house, all over in his toy box and everything. Like he just really loved playing with the cards. I don't really know what he did with them, but I ended up getting rid of all of those cards because they weren't a complete set. I was noticing while I was going through them that there was a lot missing and I'm like, well, we're not going to be able to play any games with these cards. So I'm just going to buy brand new cards the next time I get the chance to. Um, so I'm just cleaning out this drawer. I'm going to vacuum it with my favorite vacuum right here. It's my um, one of my new favorite vacuums. Um, this is the Bissell Pet Hair. It's, it's like a smart pet hair vacuum. Um, I love this vacuum. I will link it down below. I've basically been linking it in every single video since I've gotten it because I just love it so much. And I'm just cleaning it out with some Lysol. And then I'm going to go through all of the stuff that I took out of this drawer just to make sure that was me going through all of the cards to try to figure out if I had enough to save any of this, but I didn't. So, but anyway, I am basically just going to go through all this stuff. I'm going to go through all the manuals just to make sure that they, we still have the, the products of what we have the manuals for. And then I will be putting everything back into this drawer and it will be nice and organized. I've been calling out your name from the darkness, thinking it's too late. If you're fainted, I've been too much on your plate. I'll keep hiding, calling out your name, calling out your name. So here I am putting the manuals and some of the um, restaurant menus we own in there. And then there's all our barbecue, like silverware, like all our spatulas for the barbecue. And some tape, some packing tape, like tape measures, um, lighters. I uh, had some electrical tape as well. All that stuff in those bags are like screws from like things that like um, my oldest son's like crib that I still have. Um, stuff like that. And I am not really sure why we have this many playing cards. If you guys are really curious, ask Andrew in the comments down below. Because I know he watches every single one of my videos. Maybe he can answer it for you. Because I really don't know. Um, okay, now we're moving on to the cabinet below. And as you can see, it is just stuffed with things that I don't need in there. Um, I'm pretty sure some of this stuff was my dad's. And if you're new and you didn't know, my dad passed away in November of 2020. And, um, I had a lot of his stuff that I was still holding on to, and it's now like almost four years after his death and I'm just ready to get rid of everything. Um, and I'm decluttering my house in the process and it feels so good. So, um, just getting rid of all the things that like were old and just weren't being used. So yeah. So now I'm vacuuming out this, um, these little drawers and then I'm going to clean them with um, the same Lysol spray that I've been using and then I'm going to put all the stuff back in and you're going to see how much I decluttered. I got rid of like a pitch that pitcher and I got rid of um, that other flower pitcher kind of thing. I don't really know what it's called but um, I did keep like stuff like my big containers and this chopper and some other containers that I didn't want to put in my container drawer. And then on below, I am putting all of our appliances. We have a hot dog maker, a hay quesadilla maker, a waffle maker, a panini maker. We have a little bit of everything in this house. And now we are moving on to the last drawer. And um, this is my container drawer. I really did not declutter anything out of this drawer only because um, the containers still work. And I do have um, other containers that I need to wash and put in there. 
Um, maybe I'll do it in an upcoming video <laughs> um, if I ever decide to just bring them out and wash them. But as you can see, I'm just vacuuming, spraying it with Lysol, and then I'm just going to neatly put all the containers back in here. Alright, and that is the end of this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My cabinets are all nice and clean and organized, and I am so happy with the end results. Um, if you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel for more cleaning content. I will have a brand new video up next week, and I will see you guys then. Bye, guys. I'm never